We're asked to find a generating function with the closed formula a sub n equals two times the nth power of three plus four times the nth power of negative five. To do this, we'll first determine a generating function for two times the nth power of three. Then we'll determine a generating function for four times the nth power of negative five. And then we'll sum the two generating functions to find a generating function for the given closed formula. To begin, we will let b sub n be equal to two times the nth power of three and generate several of the terms in the sequence. We have n equals zero, one, two, three, and so on. Simplifying, the sequence is two, six, eighteen, fifty-four, dot, dot, dot. From here, the generating series for the sequence is g one of x equals two plus six x plus eighteen x squared plus fifty-four x cubed plus dot, dot, dot. Notice on the right side we have a common factor of two. Let's factor the two from the right. This gives us g1 of x equals two times the quantity one plus three x plus nine x squared plus 27 x cubed plus dot, dot, dot. And now focusing on the series inside the parentheses, this one should look familiar. Notice the corresponding sequence is one, three, nine, 27, and so on, where the generating function is one divided by the quantity one minus three x. Recall we found this generating function by replacing x with three x in the generating function for the sequence of ones. This indicates that g one of x is equal to two times one divided by the quantity one minus three x, which gives us two divided by the quantity one minus three x. And now let's focus on four times the nth power of negative five. Let's let c sub n equal four times the nth power of negative five. Next we generate several of the terms in the sequence. Again, we have n equals zero, one, two, three, and so on. Simplifying, the sequence is four, negative 20, 100, negative 500, dot, dot, dot. This indicates a generating series for the sequence is g two of x equals four, minus 20 x plus 100 x squared, minus 500 x cubed plus dot, dot, dot. On the right side, we have a common factor of four. Let's factor four from the right. This gives us g two of x equals four times the quantity one minus five x plus 25 x squared minus 125 x cubed plus dot, dot, dot. Again, focusing on the series inside the parentheses, notice this time the signs alternate and the coefficients are powers of five. Looking at our table, the generating function one divided by the quantity one plus x generates the series one, negative one, one, negative one, this gives us the right signs, but because our coefficients are powers of five, we need to replace x with five x. You may also recall the generating function of one divided by the quantity one plus x was found by substituting negative x for x in the generating function for the constant sequence of ones. In our case, g two of x is equal to four times one divided by the quantity one plus five x which is equal to four divided by the quantity one plus five x. So following to determine the generating function for the given closed formula, we simply sum g one of x and g two of x. This gives us a generating function, g of x equals two divided by the quantity one minus three x plus four divided by the quantity one plus five x. I hope you found this helpful.